Hi everyone and welcome to the 12 days of Christmas. I believe this is day 11 so one more to go. This one's going to be super uber quick but I thought I, I wanted to share this with you because it was so darn cute. So for our craft sale uh, my daughter and I always make these mixes with uh, you know cookie mixes. You've seen them before. The sugars in there, brown sugar flour, etc. And these ones have um, red and green Smarties. The recipe calls for M&Ms, but I think I've used Smarties before and they should be okay too because we wanted Christmas colors. So I just want to show you how I very quickly package these up and you could whip these up for uh, teachers, for friends, because they are going to be cookies for Santa. So this is something you could mix up with the kids on Christmas Eve and leave them out for Santa and it's already mixed for you. Just dump it in the bowl and the recipe's on the back and all you have to add is um, three quarters of a cup of butter and two eggs to this mix and then you just stir it all up and roll them out and cook them and your house smells like fresh cookies and I know on Christmas Eve we're so busy with so many other things it'd be fun to have some of these all ready and I'm sure anyone would appreciate this as a, as a gift if they have children so I'll put the recipe in the down bar of how you do this and layer this but just for a presentation I'll show you what I did so I took some Christmas paper so I just found this uh, it was from a really cheap like, Christmas pack and I used my EK Success circle cutter so I was able to cut out four circles at a time so instead of using fabric for the cover I have learned in the past couple of years the quickest way and the cheapest way is to use paper so you can see skews the mess all around here but I'm busy labeling and such so you give your little circle a light spritz. If it's cheap paper, you have to be really careful because it'll tear. And then just kind of crinkle it up in your hands a little bit. Then place that on your jar and gently it'll take on the shape of your jar. And it gives that semblance of um, a fabric cover. So I kind of let that dry and then I took some green twine like this and tied it around and the finished jar looks like this. And it says cookies for Santa and then on the flip side it has the recipe. So I thought that was a quick and easy gift suggestion idea cheaper than using fabric yet it looks like fabric on top it's really really cute way to package up some cookies and a really welcome gift so thanks for watching and we'll see you tomorrow for the last day day 12 bye bye